What's up guys, this is Ryan. Just want to show you guys a little something I've been making at home a lot before my training runs. It's actually something I ripped off from Gordon Ramsay's YouTube video, so I can't take too much credit here. We like to call it sexy scrambled eggs. So what I'm going to do is just put it on medium heat here, number four for me. What I got is three eggs, and what I like about this, I just crack them, put them right in the pan. And you want to put them in the pan before it's hot. And you want to start mixing right away. And the runner version of this, I do a little bit less fat than Mr. Ramsey likes to do. Maybe him being a soccer player, he likes a little extra fat. I like to keep it relatively low fat, although I do have three egg yolks in there, so I am getting in plenty of fat. But I got some Smart Balance Light instead of normal butter. And so what I learned from Gordon is the key to good scrambled eggs is constant stirring, constant movement, starting off with a cold pan, not seasoning your eggs before um, you put them on the pan. You actually season them at the end. If you season them before, it turns out that they are watery. So you want to season them after you take them off the heat. And the other thing is, as you can see, I'm taking them off and on the heat. So I don't just leave it on the heat the whole time. I just take the pan right off and leave that flame on and just keep stirring rigorously. And what's amazing about the sexy eggs, scrambled eggs, is that they taste so good with a, just a tiniest bit of butter that you put in there. I like to put in about a tablespoon of Smart Balance Light, so that's like 50 extra calories of healthy fat that you're putting in there. So again, just constant movement. Gordon said that they would hire their chefs based on if they could make quality scrambled eggs. So I figure it is important to know how to make really good quality ones. It turns out it's actually not all that hard. I like to use a spatula. He uses a spatula in his YouTube video. And I was like, spatula? That's kind of weird for something on heat. But you can get a really good feel for the, for the eggs. It's really easy to move them around. And uh, it just has a nice, nice feel on the pan to it. So we like to eat eggs all the time when we're training hard. It's obviously, you know, has omegas in there and it's got healthy fat and it's got really healthy protein. So like t tomorrow I'm doing a 90 minute long run with a hard hour in the middle of it. And this is what I'm having for dinner the night before. I'm actually going to throw this over a little bit of grits. And so the thing you're seeing here is it's starting to thicken up on me. And so once it gets to this point, which is still like mildly watery, it's going to continue to cook because the pan is hot. And so you want to start to cool the eggs down. And the way you do that is just by putting in just a dab of creme fraiche. So just take a little dab and that just cools it down. Continue to stir. Again, I haven't put in any salt or pepper yet because I don't want to turn them watery. And you want this consistency here. You want nice and soft scrambled eggs, not like how I used to make them, which was super hard, firm, dried out, overcooked, not very tasty. But when you have sexy scrambled eggs like these, you can see that is just an amazing texture right there. That's just gonna melt in your mouth. Turn my burner off. Just gonna put just a sprinkle of pepper on there. Just a dab. Just do a little bit of salt. To measure it that way, that way I can see how much I'm getting in there. And then the sexy part, get your chives on, just a little bit of diced chives there. And there you have it, healthy, delicious, sexy scrambled.